Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Marina Senina. Uh, I'm from uh, Mendeleev University of Chemical Technology of Russia. Uh, I present you my uh, research work uh, on the topic uh, dense ceramic materials made of magnesium aluminate spinel. Uh, today, among dense and high-density ceramic materials, uh, one of the most advanced uh, place in uh, occupied by transparent ceramics. Uh, due to a wide range of high-performance indicators, transparent ceramics um, uh, are used in almost all areas of uh, our life, uh, from laser materials and high-strength ammo. Today, uh, I can talk. Uh, I would uh, talk uh, about transparent ceramics, uh, which used for uh, armor protection. Uh, at the moment, uh, one of the first companies uh, that are engaged uh, in the protection of transparent armor ceramics uh, are following manufacturers shown on this slide. Uh, the main compounds from which transparent ceramics are obtained are aluminium oxide, uh, aluminium oxynitride, and uh, magnesium aluminate spinel. Uh, spinel is one of the most promising compounds nowadays. Um, the next slide shows the uh, phase diagram uh, of um, the state of uh, magnesium oxide and uh, aluminium oxide. Uh, the only chemical compound um, on this system uh, is magnesium aluminate spinel, uh, in addition to this success. There are uh, a number of solid solutions uh, in this system, uh, in which the lattice parameters uh, are changes. Uh, especially easily spinel forms a solid solution from the um, aluminum oxide, uh, which have a crystalline ties uh, close to uh, spinel. Uh, spinel ceramics uh, has a large number of useful functional properties. Uh, this is also uh, a high density, a relative lightness uh, compared to other amode materials, uh, such as uh, other ceramics and glass. Uh, but the uh, distinct, but <clears throat> but the distinguishing spinel uh, is uh, uh, comparisons with uh, aluminium oxide or um, aluminium uh, oxynitride is higher light uh, transmittance. Um, but at the moment. Uh, the technology of uh, production of uh, ceramics from spinel uh, is very expensive, uh, as from as uh, alone and um, aluminum oxide. Uh, since it requires to use uh, expensive processes uh, such as uh, hot pressing and um, high temperatures of sintering. Um, one of um, one or two uh, uh, possible solutions of this uh, problem uh, are sintering spinel ceramics uh, without expensive hot pressing uh, and the hot isostatic pressing processes by vacuum sintering without a plain pressure uh, and uh, application of sintering additives with different mechanisms of uh, action. Uh, uh, at present, uh, highly uh, effective additives are rare ioses that uh, contribute uh, to the formation of, of solid solution in both uh, subletes of magnesium aluminate spinel uh, with the uh, occurrence of vacancies. Uh, occurrence vacancies thus uh, um, in the sign, uh, a density uh, closer to theoretical uh, and the sintering stage. Uh, currently used additives such as uh, scandium oxide uh, are very expensive. Uh, gallium oxide uh, is a poorly studied uh, but perspective uh, additives. Uh, gallium oxide forms a solid solution with magnesium and aluminum spinel. Uh, however, um, uh, the complete diagram of uh, phase equilibrium in two system, uh, systems uh, 
mag magnesium oxide, aluminium oxide, gallium oxide, it's first system, and magnesium aluminum spinel uh, gallium oxide is uh, second system. Uh, all these five diagrams uh, today uh, is, uh, are absent. And uh, the completeness uh, of uh, the solution of gallium oxide in the spinel sublatize has not been fully studied. Uh, at the moment, um, the probably of formation of solid solution of uh, gallium oxide in spinel has been confirmed. Uh, it was uh, also shown in um, that um, our method uh, uh, in our research, uh, it was shown that the method uh, of introduction the added different to the um, uh, charge uh, is very important. Uh, the introduction of gallium oxide into the synthesized powder of magnesium aluminum spinel um, uh, makes it possible to obtain ceramics with uh, low values of porosity, uh, which uh, is fundamentally is to issue of obtained transparent ceramics. Uh, due to this mechanism, uh, formation defects in crystal uh, lattice from uh, oxygen vacancies. Uh, this uh, contributes um, uh, to an increase uh, uh, in the diffusion rate, which uh, ultimately uh, facilitates the sintering process uh, and contributes um, to a, a decrease in temperature. Uh, uh, one of the most important uh, technology stages in product and transparent ceramics is uh, powder synthesis. Um, the most popular methods of synthesis um, nanopowders are shown in this, on this slide. Um, for created uh, energy efficient uh, technologies, uh, it is important that the synthesis methods is uh, as low as possible, and it is also important that uh, it is well reproducible. Uh, in our work, uh, we choose thermal synthesis from salts and hydroxides. Um, uh, this method was chosen for synthesis uh, uh, magnesium and aluminum spinel powders. Uh, the next slide shows uh, the uh, starting materials and the technological scheme for obtained samples. Uh, spinel uh, powder was synthesized from uh, aluminium hydroxide, uh, which obtained by precipitation from aluminium nitrate and uh, magnesium carbonate. Uh, when the uh, synthesized powder was uh, added more addition of gallium oxide, uh, samples is, uh, were formed by the method of semi dry pressing and uh, sintering in a vacuum. Uh, Essential additives in the form of, uh, of uh, gallium nitrate salt was introduced into the spinel powders in the um, amount of uh, 3, 5, 7, 9, um, 11, 13, and 15 mol moles percent. Uh, uh, in the spinel process, uh, uh, is uh, in a wide temperature range. Uh, according to differential scanning colorimeter data, uh, the one set of spinel phase formation falls on um, 550 degrees, and then continues up to about 1000 degrees. However, based on the result of, of part studies uh, to complete the, the formation of spinel phase, uh, it is uh, advantageous to choose a temperature of uh, 1,020 yes, degrees. Yes, 1,200 degrees. Yes, 1,200 degrees. I'm sorry. Um, and uh, in our research, we uh, obtained uh, spinel powders uh, uh, on this temperature, uh, 1,200 degrees. Next slide shows the result uh, X-ray phase analysis um, on the uh, sintered spinel powder. Uh, the diffractogram shows that the result in powders is uh, the only spinel phase. Uh, 
next slides uh, show uh, shows uh, different scanning calorimetry of the spinel with gallium oxide uh, in uh, different concentrations. Um, on this uh, all, all uh, this key data uh, at temperatures up to uh, 300 degrees, a removal of water and the decomposition of gallium nitrate. Uh, and uh, it is uh, consistent with the literature data. Uh, with uh, an increase um, uh, in the concentration of gallium oxide, uh, a decrease in temperature is absorbed for the formation of solid solution initially uh, 472 degrees to 415 degrees. And uh, then, uh, Yes, uh, then with um, an increased concentration of uh, gallium oxide to 9 uh, mole percent, uh, we can see uh, a slight uh, increase in temperature of beginning of formation of solid solution occurs. But um, uh, in the future, increase uh, in concentration of gallium oxide from 11 to uh, 15 mole percent uh, with the temperature of formation of solid solution decreases to uh, 440 degrees. Uh, then uh, uh, we can say uh, in uh, this research that increase uh, in the gallium oxide contributes uh, to a decrease uh, in the temperature of formation of solid solutions. Uh, which in turn decreases the synthesis temperature of such ceramics as a whole. Uh, as a result of the work, uh, it was uh, revealed that um, uh, gallium oxide forms a solid solution with magnesium aluminate spinel, which makes it possible to intensify sintering and obtain a denser material in the future. Uh, that's all what I want, you, want to say to you today. Um, thank you for your attention.